All right, we're gonna take a little cruise here. 1957 Cadillac, Coupe de Ville. Man, this is what class is all about. This is the deluxe version. Uh, it's got power steering, power brakes. It's got power windows, power seat. It's got about everything but air conditioning. But original AM radio. There's the heater down there. Interior's original on it. It's got a little wear and tear, but you know, no rips or tears. In pretty good shape. A little wear on the edges. But it's got brand new uh, wide white wall radials on there too, which is pretty cool. Just had about 10 grand spent on it. Miscellaneous things here and there. And uh, it's just a good, good driver. Finished in Alpine white. It's got the two-tone with the black, black roof. It's got a nice look on a two-door hardtop. Means you put all the windows down. You got no post. I used this in a TV series. Uh, I don't know. That was over 10 years ago too. Called Vegas. It was one of the little primary cars in there for a little bit. It was, took place in the 50s, so it's got a little bit of Hollywood magic done to it, too. But all the chrome and everything is nice on the car, and it seems like it cruises down the road real good. Odometer works and everything like that, too. Pretty sweet. This belonged to a buddy of mine, actually. We're still friends, and he's, he's a car guy, and he's had it for, I sold it to him nine years ago. So uh, he's got his use out of it, had fun with it. Now it's time to move on and get something different. Anyway, we'll go up here, we'll take some more pictures and more video for you. All right, we're gonna take a little walk around this really cool 1957 Cadillac Coupe de Ville Deluxe. Two-door hardtop. This one's got a nickname of Cruella de Ville. You know, 101 Dalmatians, black and white. Kind of looks like Cruella. Pretty neat caddy right here. Got the fins on it. Got the hideaway uh, little gas door here. A lot of people don't know that took that to a full-serve gas station never figure out where to put the gas but it's finished in alpine white it's got some brand new wide white wall radials on there hubcaps are in great shape all the stainless trim is nice even these little flappers are nice they work the way they're supposed to old paint but nice you know still looks good you can go cruising in it cars and coffee up the coast whatever it's got the 365 v8 in it automatic transmission factory power steering and power brakes so kind of some options, you know. Also has power windows in it, power seat, heater. Believe it or not, that was an option back then. But original inside, little colors coming off the leather that are there that could probably be dyed. But you know what, a survivor. These seats are like a couch. But all the chrome work on the dash, everything is nice. The dashboard itself is in good shape. That cool steering wheel, giant. Door panels are in good shape too. Got the wrap around windshield. I always like that. I have a 58 Impala. It's got the same roof line actually. And those really cool hubcaps. She's a cruiser. Some heavy metal right there. Here's the power plant in the 57 Caddy. 365 cubic inch Cadillac motor. Backed by a automatic transmission. There's the power steering and the power brakes over there. Go ahead and fire this one up for you real quick. Yeah, it runs real good. They got a giant brake pedal. Power brakes. There's your power windows right there. Remote mirror. It's loaded with options. That's a good running little Cadillac motor. Got the old generator on there. That's what power brakes looked like back then. Got a piece of art. Walk around the back so you can hear it. That was nice. Nice dual exhaust going all the way out the back. Nice chrome. Pretty neat car. Well, if you want to come out and see this one in person, come out to see me in California Cars here. We're at 2158 Union Place in the city of Simi Valley, California. Phone number here is 818. 591-1313 and my name is Rich I'd be happy to uh, show you the car and give you the story it's got a good history thanks for watching